So, Joseph, what do you want to do today? Uh, I don't know, dude. Wait, where's Cody? I don't know. <laughs> oh, baby, you know me so well. <laughs> oh, you're such a freak. Oh, you nasty, nasty girl. All right, I'll see you later, Mom. Wait, that was your mom? Yeah. So that wasn't a hot girl on the phone? Ew, no. My mom's like a six at best. Oh, so what do you guys want to do today? Whoa, look over there. What? <laughs> I made you look. What? Seriously, dude? What made you look? What, what? What? It's like a prank. What, are we kindergartners, dude? Yeah, what a five-year-old little joke. Like, oh, made you look. Hey, Cody, look over there. No, there's nothing there. No, no, look, Cody, it's the coolest thing ever. No, there's obviously not going to be anything. Cody, look. No. <laughs> Made you look! Yeah, you literally made me look. Oh, isn't that so funny? Wasn't that really funny, Joseph? <laughs> yeah, dude, hilarious. Yeah, so <laughs> funny. Oh, made you look. It's dumb. You're five years old. <sighs> Alright, guys. You guys just want to watch a movie? Oh, yeah, with popcorn! Yeah, popcorn! Yeah, and butter? Yeah. And salt? Yeah. Alright, yeah! Let's go ask Chef Pee to make us some popcorn. Alright. Oh, man, oh, man! I gotta hurry up and finish this dinner for my boss! Oh, let me taste test it. Oh my god, that's horrible! Hey, Chef Pee Pee, can you make some popcorn for me and my friends? No, Junior, I'm cooking this dinner for your dad! But we want some popcorn! I don't care what you want, I have to cook this dinner for your dad! But we want popcorn! Mm. You know what, Junior? Give me that popcorn! Give me the popcorn right now! Give me the damn popcorn! Alright! You got it? I'm cooking the damn popcorn right now! Chef Pee Pee! What do you want, boss? Alright, Junior, I'll be right back! Guys, you know what would be really funny? If we pull a prank on Chef Pee Pee, we should hide in the microwave, and then when he goes to open the microwave, we jump out. <laughs> yeah. Let's do it. Come on, guys. Get in the microwave. Okay, dude. <laughs> what, boss? Is my food ready yet, peasant? Who are you calling a peasant? And no, it'll be ready in five minutes. I could die in five minutes. My food better be ready sooner than that. <laughs> I can't stand my boss. Always yelling at me and wanting me to cook and clean. Oh, yeah, yeah. Junior, stupid popcorn. Let me start it. Wait, what's that noise? Chef Pee Pee, turn the microwave on. What's that mean? We're gonna die, dude! The radiation's gonna kill us. Wait, help! 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 I've been cooking all day. I'm getting tired. Oh, that must be Junior's popcorn. Show <gasps> your Joseph Cody! What are you doing in the microwave? Uh, what the hell are you doing in the microwave? I told you not to be in the kitchen. Get out! Oh, come on, guys. Uh, uh, I don't feel good. Well, of course not, Junior. We just got microwaved. Is that bad? Yes, Junior. That's very, very bad. We soaked up so much radiation, I'm surprised our heads didn't explode. Well, what can radiation do? Well, it can give you cancer. Or superpowers, dude. No, that only happens in comic books. Shut up, Cody. You're such a nerd. Yeah, yeah. Shut up, Cody. You're stupid. Well, I, I'm not stupid. You're stupid. Come on, Cody. I'm not stupid. You're stupid. You can do so much better than that. You should have called him a bib-wearing baby because he wears a bib all the time. <laughs> yeah, and then Joseph would have high-fived me. Would have been awesome. Why'd you call me that, Cody? What? You just called me a bib wearing baby. Well, no, I didn't. Hey, Joseph, you heard him say that, right? No, he didn't say anything, dude. He said, I wish I would have called you a bib wearing baby. Why would you call me that? But, J -J Junior, I don't know what you're talking about. Huh, that was weird. How did Junior know I wanted to call him a bib wearing baby? Huh, but still, Junior's so sexy. I want to make out with him so hard. Ew, Cody, you just said you wanted to make out with me really hard. What? what? No, no, Junior, I didn't say that. I was thinking it. Ew, why would you even think that? That's gross. Wait, wait how did I just hear your thoughts? Oh my god, Junior, did you just read my mind? Wait, I can read minds? Well, okay, let's try it out. Uh, I'm gonna think of a number between 1 and 100, and you read my mind and tell me what it is. Okay. Ken's freshly waxed booty hole. What number was it, Junior? What number was I thinking of? It wasn't a number at all. <laughs> no, it's not. But still, that means I can read minds! Yeah, that's really cool. I'm gonna try to read Joe's mind. Oh man, I hope you never find the knife that I used to cut my neighbor's throat. Oh man, I could go to jail for a long time. What was he thinking about, Junior? Uh... Cereal? Oh, how did you know, dude? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's so cool that you can read mine. Yeah, cereal. <laughs> um, I'm going to see if I can read my dad's mind. Oh, Chef Pee taking forever with my food. He needs to hurry up. Uh, hey, Dad. Not right now, Junior. I'm hungry and I'm mad. Well, what are you thinking about? I'm thinking about how I don't want you annoying me right now, so leave. God, Junior's so annoying. I wish I would have adopted a girl instead of him. What? Dad, am I adopted? Uh, <laughs> no. What makes you think that? <laughs> Go downstairs and check on Chef Pee Make sure that my food's done. Oh man, all this popcorn everywhere? Now I have to clean up this huge mess? Hey Chef Pee is my dad's food ready? No, and it's not gonna be ready anytime soon because you made this huge mess! Oh, okay. 
Oh, just think of happy thoughts, Jeff PP. Happy thoughts, happy thoughts. Oh, like your first kiss. Oh, it was in Boy Scouts and it was with a boy named Freddy. I kind of liked it though, but I can never let anybody know my secret. Who's Freddy? Oh, but how did you know about Freddy? Look, we just bumped the heads. I didn't like it. Okay. Just go, get out, stop interrogating me. <laughs> hey, Junior, what was your dad thinking about? I think I'm adopted. Oh. I also read Chef Peepee's mind. Ooh, what was he thinking about, dude? I don't know. I don't think I can talk about it. Well, well it's still really cool that you have superpowers. I know. Maybe you guys have superpowers, too. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Joseph, what do you think your superpower is? Ooh, maybe I have laser vision. I can shoot laser beams at my eyes. Ooh, you should try it. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 oh, is that a human torch? So he's burning alive? Yeah. Oh, let me see what he's thinking about. Oh, man, I remember when I went to Boy Scouts, and I said my name was Freddy, and I kissed Chef Pee Pee, but I told him that we would never talk about this ever again. <laughs> What was he thinking about? Uh, he said he wants us to call the fire department. He wants water and to be put out, you know. That makes sense. Hello? Hey, you got a call about a fire? Yeah, my friend's on fire! Oh, is he? Yeah, he's like on fire with flames and everything! Wait, like for real? Yeah, like for real, come on! Oh man, I really hope this kid doesn't find out that I'm not actually a firefighter. I'm just a male stripper, and when he said that his friend was on fire, I thought he meant he was really hot, like he wanted me to take my clothes off. Well, what are you doing? Come on! Uh, yeah, okay, I'm coming. Okay, my friend's right here! Oh my god, he's burned to a crisp! What happened? Well, we wanted to scare my chef, so we got in the microwave when he was making popcorn, and he accidentally microwaved us, and then we all got superpowers, and his superpower was to light himself on fire, and then he burned himself to death. Okay, these kids are nucking futs. They obviously just killed their friend and then made up the story about the superpowers afterward. Alright, so what do I do here? Uh, I mean, I should call the cops, but... Wait, wait a minute, I am a cop. Uh, I mean, I have the outfit out in the car, but... No, 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 I don't want to do that. Oh, God, if I arrest him, I'm just going to have so much paperwork. I just want to go home and eat a TV dinner. Oh, God, that'd be good. Oh, yeah, chicken and dumplings? Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, do I have one in the fridge? I think I do. I mean, I had one last week, but there's probably still one in there, right? Well, it's okay. If there's not, I'll just go by the store afterward. What? Oh, God, but that's a whole thing. No, no. Okay, okay, you know what? If there's not one in there, I'll just order pizza. But I'm the pizza man. Oh, man, I have so many jobs, and I can't even afford to pay the bills. What's going on? Oh, oh, no. It's been a really long time, and I haven't said anything. These kids probably think I'm crazy. They probably know I'm a male stripper, and I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, I, I, I can't help you. Sorry. B bye. So, Junior, what was that guy thinking about the whole time? I don't know. Something about eating chicken and dumplings? Ooh, chicken and dumplings. So is Joseph really dead? Yeah, I think so, Junior. What's the point of having a superpower that lets you catch on fire if it hurts you? I know, what a lame power. Uh, what do you think my power is? Ooh, maybe your power is to bring people back to life. You should try it. Okay. <laughs> huh? What? Cody, you just cloned yourself! Oh, a pretty sexy clone of myself. Oh, you're not so bad yourself. <laughs> Wanna make out? Sure. Co Cody, 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 Cody! Huh? You can clone yourself? Yeah! Oh my god, do you think you can clone yourself a third time? Let's find out. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? What's cooking good looking? Oh, Junior, I'm about to have a menage a moi. What? There's three Cody's? Alright, Cody, that's too many Cody's. <laughs> Junior, there's no such thing as too many Cody's. But could you get Joseph's body out of here? I need room for all my Cody's. Yeah, I'll move Joseph's body. All right, Cody, I moved Joseph's body. Thanks, Junior! What? Cody! Why are there so many Cody's? Yeah, sorry, Junior, I have a problem. I just couldn't stop. What are you gonna name all these people? Well, the one above me is Cody. What's up? And then next to him is Cody. What's up? And then the one next to him is Cody. What's up? And then that one's Cody. What's up? And then this one's Cody. What's up? And then that one over there is Cody. What's up? And then that one... Oh, what's his name? Oh, yeah, that's right, it's Cody with a K. What's up? Uh, Cody, that is way too many Cody's! Well, Junior, like I said, there's no such thing as too many Cody's. Well, what are you gonna do with all these Cody's? We're gonna have a big gay party, right? Yeah! yeah. Okay. What, 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 Cody, don't you think it's dangerous for all those Cody's to be out in the wild? Well, yeah, now that you mention it, I don't know if the world's ready for that much hunkiness. It might implode. Oh, well, we gotta go stop all those Cody's! Yeah, let's go wrangle some Cody's! He's mine! No, he's mine! Uh, Cody, they have Ken! Get your hands off of my boyfriend! Well, get Ken! I can't, Junior! Don't you know how hunky I am? Nobody can fry my fingers off of Ken. My mom has tried. Well, well, what if we have a superpower we didn't know we had yet? Well, like what? Like, like, what if we did have laser vision like Joseph thought? Uh, pew! Well, well, Cody, wait, I have laser vision! Oh, yeah, get that one, get that one! Okay. Pew! Well, well, Cody, oh. I have laser vision! Oh, Ken, my baby! Cody, what if you have laser vision too? Take your glass off, go see! Okay. All right, Junior, I got my glasses off. What? You're just still so ugly. Just focus, Junior. Do you have laser vision or not? Let's find out. Pew! You have laser vision! Alright, let's kill some Cody's! Look, Junior, there's a Cody on the stairs! 
I got him. Pew! Nice shot, Junior, but don't get cocky. All right, let's get the other ones. Yeah. Look, Junior, there's two Cody's playing with their balls. Let's get them at the same time. All right. Pew! Yeah, we yeah. got him! <laughs> Do you see any more Cody's? Oh, my God. It's Banana Cody. Oh my god. You gotta waste him, Junior. But he's so cool, though. That's what he does. He gets in your head and makes you think he's cool, so you don't want to kill him, but you gotta kill him, Junior. <gasps> okay. <sighs> oh, I don't want to do that. That's for the best, Junior. Okay, there's only one left. <sighs> there's the last Cody. He's drinking Dr. Pepper. Dr. P, not in front of me. I got him. No, I got him. <laughs> <sighs> Okay, we got rid of all the Cody's. Yeah, I feel kind of bad. I wish we kept at least one, you know, just so we can, like, do stuff to it. Well, then just make one. Okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's not working. Try harder. <laughs> oh, 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 I, I pooped. What? I pooped in my pants. You pooped? I pooped. What? You? No way. I did. I pooped in my pants. I, I, it's, I, I'm gonna have to change because I pooped. Oh my god. Yeah. I, I smell I smell it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I I'm very sorry. <laughs> you know what that means? You know what that means? <laughs> <laughs> well, sorry about that, but I had to change my clothes, so I changed into banana cody! Ba -ba -da -da, banana cody. Joseph's dead, but he'll be back in the next video. Ba -da -ba -da -da -da. If you want superpowers three, just like, comment, and subscribe. Ba -da -ba -da -da, banana cody. What's wrong, Cody? Well, it's just that me and Ken want to have a baby, but we can't because we're two dudes. He's a dog, Cody! He's not a dog, Joseph! Why do you and Ken want to have a baby? Well, it's just that we've been together for a long time, and it would be cool to have a little Ken Jr. running around. Where do babies even come from, dude? I think girls poop them out of their butts. Ew. Yeah, that's what I heard, but we don't have a girl's butt. So I made a machine that can make babies! You made a machine that can make babies? Yeah, let me go get it. Ba 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 behold you guys ba 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 baby machine ba 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 b a b y machine ba 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 patent pending. Whoa! Ba 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 baby machine. What's it do? Yeah. I just explained that it makes babies. Well, how's it work? Oh, well, you put the DNA of one person here, and then you put the DNA of another person here, and then the machine combines the DNA to make a baby. Well, if you already made a baby machine, why'd you even tell us about it? Why don't you just make a baby? Oh, well, cause Ken here doesn't have any DNA. Because he's a doll, dude. No, Joseph. It's because his DNA got burned off when he was in space exploring the universe and he encountered aliens because he had to save the planet of Quadrillion and the only way he could save it is if they burned off all his DNA. What? Do you even hear yourself, dude? Well, look, guys, the point is I need someone's DNA. Well, you can't have mine. I don't even like you, dude. <sighs> I guess I'll give you my DNA since we're best buds. Well, J Junior, I was actually thinking we'd use Chef Pee-Pee's DNA. Chef Pee-Pee's DNA? Why his? Well, have you seen him? He's gorgeous. My DNA combined with his? Our baby would be rocking. He'd be a supermodel. Chef Pee-Pee is really hot. Yeah, he's banging. Okay, so how do we get Chef Pee-Pee's DNA? Okay, I was thinking I would dress up like a girl, right? And then I'd go on Tinder, and then I'd match with him, and then we'd go on a date, and then he'd invite me back to his house, and then he'd want to do it, but then I'd be like, no, I want to wait till marriage. And then we wait, and we date for two years. And then, when we finally get married, we go on a honeymoon to Hawaii, and then right when we're about to make sweet, passionate love, I pluck out one of his hairs and run away. Isn't there a quicker way to do it? I mean, I guess you could just get his hair right now from the kitchen, but I mean, that'd be boring, and I already have the girl outfit ready. I'm just gonna go grab one of his hairs right now. Aw, oh, come on, I already bought the plane tickets. Julia, your ham and cheese sandwich is ready! Thanks, Chef PB. Wait, why aren't you wearing your hairnet? Junior, I'm not a lunch lady. I don't need a hairnet. Well, you get hair in my food all the time. I don't get hair in your food. Just get your sandwich and eat it already. Perfect. All right, Cody, take your pick. Look at all the hair you got. Ew! That much hair? Yeah, he's getting old. Ugh, I'll just take some of this hair, put it here, and then for my DNA, <laughs> Yuck. Okay, so now I just set it to 350 degrees, put it on toast, and leave it for about an hour. An hour? What are we gonna do for an hour? Yeah. I don't know, make out. What? What? I, I, I mean, make another sandwich? We, we could do that. Oh, can we watch? No, 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 don't take that off. Uh, uh, you, you'll, you'll go blind and grow hair in your palms if you watch a baby being made. That, that's what my parents told me. Okay, I guess we'll just sit here for an hour. <sighs> you, you gonna eat that sandwich? No. Oh, you mind if I eat it? I can take the hair off for you. No, no, no. I like that. 
What, it's done already? Yep, power video editing, Junior. It's a hell of a thing. So there's a baby in there? Yeah. Wait, so that was lame? W what do you mean? There was no like special effects, it just dinged. There was no like lightning bolts or anything. But Junior, do you think we have time for all that? This video has to be up by tomorrow. I just think it would've been cool if there was a lightning bolt. Okay, fine, little lightning bolt. Bam, there you go, that took 10 minutes. 10 minutes for that? Yep, 10 minutes just for that little thing. I guess that was cool. All right, I'm gonna open this up, but cover your eyes, it's gonna be bright AF. <laughs> Joseph, it's the miracle of childbirth! Hey, little guy, I'm your daddy. Hey! What are you gonna name him, Cody? I'm gonna name him Chaz. Can you say that, little guy? Ch- Ch- His first words! Aw, oh, Cody, I want a baby! Well, Junior, you know how to use the machine. Hand me that sandwich. <laughs> it's okay, Chaz, just the machine. Okay, so I just open the door? Yeah, and cover your eyes, it'll be bright. Okay. No, 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 it's okay, Chaz. It's just your half-brother. So what are you gonna name him, Junior? I'm gonna name him... Junior Junior. Wait, Junior Junior? That's a stupid name. It's better than Chaz. Wait, no, Chaz is a great name. <laughs> yeah, you tell him, Chaz. <laughs> Do you think we should tell Chef Pee about his kids? Yeah, they should probably meet their biological father. All right, I'm gonna go get Chef Pee I'll see you in a minute, Junior Junior. Mwah. What do you want, Junior? I'm very busy. Say hello to your children, Chef Pee Pee. Puppy. <laughs> Whoa, Chef Pee Pee, language. We don't want our kids growing up with potty mouths. Yeah, don't cuss in front of them, Chef Pee Pee. What the f is going on? What? Well, these are your kids, Chef Pee Pee. This is Junior Junior. The puppy. And this is Chad. <laughs> these are not my kids, Junior. I don't have children. What the hell is going on here? They are your kids, Chef Pee Pee. I took your hair and I put it in the baby machine and it had baby. J -j Junior, it's a b -b baby machine. Oh, yeah, I forgot. It's a b -b baby machine. B -b -b baby <laughs> machine. B -b baby, baby. Junior, pay attention. I did not consent to this. What the hell is going on here? These are not my children. They are your kids. Do you want a DNA test? Yes, I want a DNA test. I want a DNA test right there now. All right, Chef Pee Pee. We got the test results back, and you are the father. I told you. I told you they were yours. 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 I mean, look, there's no denying it. They have your head. Yeah, they have your head, no, they have your right. eyes, they no. have your mustache, they have your nose, they have your damn mother face. All right, all right, enough arguing. Look, there's no denying it. These are your kids. No, I didn't make these kids. I had nothing to do with this. Yeah, see, I was wondering about that, because, like, you had kids with minors, so that's got to be illegal, right? No, no, they were made in this machine, this stupid uh, toaster oven. The b -b baby machine. The baby, baby, baby machine. The baby. You know what? I'm going to act like these stupid brats don't exist. They don't exist in my world. Well, Chef, baby, you can't be a deadbeat father. They need a father figure, baby. <laughs> Let, let's just give Chef Pee Pee some time. It's gotta be hard to swallow that he has two kids he doesn't know about. Well, if he had swallowed, he wouldn't have kids in the first place. Yeah, so, look, let's just give Chef Pee Pee some time. Look, Ken's a good step stepfather, right? Yeah, but I mean, the stepfather's never the same. <laughs> but he is your father, Chad. <laughs> look, let's just give Chef Pee Pee a few minutes to calm down. Okay. <sighs> Hey, Chef Pee Pee. What do you want, Junior? I'm trying to cook. Are you going to Junior Junior's piano recital tonight? No, I told you I can't. I have to work tonight. You know you haven't been to one recital? Look, I paid for the recitals. <laughs> How about you just buy the DVDs and we watch it as a family later? You know the DVDs aren't the same. He knows you're not there. He won't know. Horse crap. He always says, where's my father? Where's my father? He knows you're missing. Look, I didn't want the bride in the first place. Then you should have wrapped it before you tapped it. I didn't tap anything. <sighs> Pee Pee. Oh, what do you want, Cody? Chaz is going on a field trip and he needs $10 for a sack lunch. <laughs> a sack lunch? Why can't he just take a lunch from home? Oh, Frosted Flakes and Doritos. Didn't have that last week. You know, if you talk to him more often, you know he doesn't even like that. <sighs> God, look, here's a $20 bill. Just bring me the change back. Okay, fine. I guess that's $10 for the sack lunch and $10 for the back child support. Child support? God, I hate my life. Chef Pee Pee! What, boss? I noticed that you've been sad lately and you've been making a lot of Frosted Flakes and Doritos. You know I don't like that. So tell me what's going on. What's wrong in Chef Pee Pee's world. Well, I have to pay child support for two kids that I didn't even know I had or made. Well, that sucks. I hate it when that happens. Well, who's the mother? Well, your son's one of them and your son's friend. Ew, that's gay. Well, aren't you mad that I had a kid with your kid? No, I'm not even mad. You know what? I'm a granddad now. Where's the little rascal at? Well, I think he's upstairs with Junior. Oh, okay, I've got to see him. All right, kids, it's time to learn your vowels. A-E-I-O-U and sometimes Y. Junior, that's a Q. 
No, that's a Y. No, in the vowels, there's a Q. That's an O. Not in the word vowels. Hey, Junior, what are you doing? Oh, hey, Dad. I'm just teaching my kid vowels. Wait, you haven't met your grandson yet, have you? No, I have not. This is your grandson, Junior Junior. Grandpappy. Wow, he is ugly. Wait, don't say that about your grandson. My bad, I didn't know he was that ugly, but damn. Wait, well, he looks just like his dad. Who looks like Chef Pee Pee? Who doesn't pay child support? Chef Pee Pee doesn't. Chef Pee Pee doesn't. It's really hard being a single mother. Yeah, I wouldn't know anything about that, but you have fun doing that. <sighs> All right, let's, let's learn our vowels again. A E I Q U Y. A E I Q U Y. Junior, you confused them. Well, if Chef Pee was here to help take care of his kids, they wouldn't be confused. Let's go have a talk with Chef Pee and say he needs to be around more. Yeah. All right, Cody. Are you sure you want to have this conversation? <sighs> I think so. All right. Chef Pee can you please come in here? <sighs> what do you want, Junior? Well, me and Cody were talking. And we think we should have a serious talk with you. Yeah, and I brought Ken along. I hope you don't mind, but I think he should be here for this. I don't care! What do you want? Well, me and Cody think. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, oh, Junior, be strong. be strong. It's just so hard! I know, I know. We can do this. Um, me and Cody think, uh, you're a bad father. Yes, exactly. I wasn't trying to be a good father! Well, see, that's the problem. You're not trying. Yeah, we want you to try, Chef, but just try to care about your kids. Just try a little bit. I don't care about those stupid kids! Look, where are they anyway? <laughs> What, Chaz? What, Junior, Junior, you get off that balcony right now. Chaz, get down, get down from there. That's okay, they're playing. Yeah, they're, they're just playing. Wow, you guys are good parents, huh? Yeah, we're good parents. We always make sure they're okay and they're taken care of, unlike you. Wait, what was that? Well, stop trying to change the subject, Chef Baby. We always make sure that the kids are safe and nothing ever goes wrong with them. See, you don't even care if they're okay. You don't even care if they're hurt or if they're crying or anything. Wait, wait, I swear I heard a thud. Well, stop trying to change the subject, Chef Baby. They are completely fine. But without you in their life, they're going to be sad and they're going to end up being like criminals when they grow up. I don't care. Yeah, do you even know what happened to Chaz today at school? What happened to Chaz today at school? He got beat up on the playground by PJ Crenshaw. What, PJ Crenshaw? Yeah, PJ Crenshaw. A pair of Jamie's Crenshaw? Jamie James Crenshaw, that's him. Oh my god. What the f***? What? what? Well, who is PJ Crenshaw? PJ Crenshaw is the coolest kid on the planet. Yeah, everyone knows that. Yeah, you would know that if you talked to your kid, Chef PB. Nobody cares about a PJ Crenshaw. The whole school does and the whole world does because he's the coolest kid ever. If you get beat up by PJ Crenshaw, you're nobody for the rest of your life. Yeah. Who is PJ Crenshaw? <sighs> it's not working, Cody. No, he's not getting it. You're just a bad father, Chef PB. Try to be a good father. Come on, Ken. <laughs> Oh, I'll show you a good father. Hello? Good evening. My name's Mr. Goodman, and I'm here with Child Protective Services, and I'm here to take the kids. Thank God. They're upstairs. Come here. Junior, Junior, eat your plastic pizza. <laughs> eat your plastic pizza. <laughs> eat the plastic banana, Chaz. You need the potassium. <laughs> junior, guess who's here? Oh, no. Who's that? It's Child Services. Child Services? Cody, child services! Oh, oh no, what are they doing here? I'm here to take the children. What, to take our children? What, why? Because your kids trying to feed your children plastic food. Well, if we got real child support, we'd be able to feed them real food, so blame Chef Pee Pee. Don't blame me, I have nothing to do with this. Hold on, wait a minute. What? Your head on their body? Can someone tell me what the hell's going on here? Well, Chef Pee Pee had kids with us, he doesn't want to take care of them. No, I didn't have kids. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You had kids with kids? No! Oh, I'm calling the cops! What the, it was with that b -b baby machine. Yeah, b -b baby machine, the baby, baby, baby machine. Y'all made kids with a baby machine? Oh, I'm definitely taking the kids now. No, no, please, I'll take our kids! Okay, fine. You get 60 seconds to say your goodbyes, and then I'm taking them. Oh, no! No, I don't want to lose you, Junior Junior! Puppy! I never got you that puppy. I love you so much! I love you, puppy! Oh, I love you! Oh, Chaz. <laughs> yeah, I don't want you to go either, buddy. <laughs> Wait, listen, Chaz, you're gonna grow up to be the biggest, gayest, hunkiest dude ever. I just know it. Oh, Chef PB, do you want to say goodbye? F*** them kids. Oh, Junior, Junior! Oh, yeah. All right, time's up. I'll take the kids now. No, no! Oh, come yeah. on, I love you, Junior, Junior! Uh, call, call me on Christmas! Come on. <laughs> Cody, I miss them already. I know, losing a kid is the hardest thing. Oh, I miss them so much. Yeah. Well, can't we just make more babies with the b -b -b baby machine? No, they just take those babies away, too. Oh, I guess you're right. So what are you going to do with the machine now? Uh, I have a few ideas.
B -b -b baby Machine. Hey there, I'm Cody, founder and CEO of B -b Baby Machine. Have you ever wanted to have a baby but didn't feel like getting pregnant for nine months and also maybe you're a child? Well, now you can with B -b Baby Machine. How's it work, you might ask? Well, all you have to do is put the DNA of two people up here, set it at 350 degrees for an hour, and you've got yourself a B -b -b Baby. Now, I know you might be thinking, Cody, a B -b Baby Machine? That's going to cost me like a million dollars, right? Well, nope. For only 18 payments of 19 95, you too can have a b -b -b baby machine. B -b -b baby machine. All right, class. Today I'm gonna go around and pass out your test from yesterday. And just to let you all know, everyone did bad. Oh no, we all did bad. Dingy dude, I can't fail again. You must be lying, because I know I didn't fail. I didn't fail either. All right, Patrick, here's your test back. You fail. Oh, man. Here you go, Roy. You fail. Ugh, that's totally not cool. And here you go, Little T. You fail. Oh, man. Obviously, you failed, Jeffy. Oh, man. You're telling me all the answers aren't Jevin? And of course you failed, Bori. <laughs> Whatever, I didn't even try. All right, Junior, here your test, you fail. Failed? My dad's totally gonna ground me. Ha ha, Junior, you failed. Shut up, Penelope. And here you go, Penelope, here your test, you failed. What? I've never failed a test in my life. This must be a mistake. Ha ha. And Joseph, here you go, here your test, you failed. Oh man, well at least I don't have parents to check my grades. Wow, that really does suck for you guys. I can't believe I'm the only one in the class who didn't fail. <laughs> Fail is what you did, Cody. Here your test. Fa fail? No, 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 no. I, I don't fail. No, you must have graded this wrong. What, what, no, 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 no. I, I was in a rush. All right, stop your whining, Crass. You all fail, which means you're all dumb. <sighs> Come on, teacher. There must be some extra credit we can do. I have to wipe this F off my record. You could have at least just given me a big hard D. Extra credit? I'm glad you said that, Cody, because I have a series of games we could Pray. And it's ironic because I'm Korean. But how would you crash right to play the games? And the winner of those games gets an A in the crash for the whole year and no homework. No homework for a year? Games? I love games! An A for the whole year? Yes! We, we want to play! We want to play! We want to play! play. play. Okay, good. Everyone wants to play. So the first game we're gonna play. Who is that? Who? Him? Oh, that's my friend. He's just cold all the time, so he likes to wear a jacket, a mask, and gloves. But anyway... Why does he have a gun? Because he's got to stay strapped because the streets are tough. But anyway, the first game we're going to play is Red Right, Green Right. So what you're going to do is everyone's going to line up at the back of the class, and when I say Green Light, you're going to run towards the board. But when I say Red Light, you're going to stop. If you're moving when I say Red Light, then you're going to get eliminated by getting shot with the Nerf gun. Okay? And whoever reaches the board is safe, but whoever doesn't is eliminated. So everyone, go to the back of the class. We're about to start. Oh man, this is so cool. All I have to do is win a few games and I get no homework for a year? Junior, don't pretend you're gonna win this. I'm gonna get that A. This isn't a math game, dude. This is red light, green light. It's about who's the fastest. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Guys, why don't we all work together? That way we all get A's. Shut up, Penelope. Yeah, shut up, Penelope. I'm gonna win this. All right, let me repeat the rules. On green right, you run towards the board. When I say red right, you stop. If you move on red right, you're gonna get eliminated with the Nerf gun. Okay, let's begin. Green right! Ah! <laughs> I'm super fast, dude! Red right! <laughs> oh. Oh, oh. Did he just get shot? Jesus Christ! Dude, it was just a Nerf bullet. I think he's actually dead. Nobody move. Anybody moving? All right. Uh, green right! Uh, start walking, dude! No, Cody, you start walking! I'm not moving. Uh, uh, Jeffy, are you gonna move? Yeah! Uh -oh. Red light! <gasps> Alright, that's two dead so far! Green right! Run towards the board! Run towards the board! <laughs> I made it to the board, I'm safe! Me too, me too! Me too! You're crazy! Dude, I'm so happy to be alive! Yeah, me too! Alright, congratulations, Crass. You finished this round. Now go back to your desk and get ready for the next game. Get the dead bodies out of here and get the cookies ready. Yeah, just doing my neighborhood patrol since they took my cop car away. <laughs> Wait a minute. Do I smell burning bodies? 
Huh. It smells like it's coming from inside this grill. Let's take a look. Jesus Christ! Holy guacamole! Jinkies! How'd that get in there? That's not good! I should really do something about this instead of opening and closing this grill over and over again! Okay. All right, they're already dead, but let's think about this. Okay, if I hide behind this grill, whoever put the bodies in there will probably come back with more bodies, and then I can catch them. All right. Oh, dude, I don't want to play this anymore. Me either. It's not worth dying. But we have to play so that we all pass. Yeah, I'd rather die than fail. Uh, teacher, can we stop playing? Yeah. All right, Crass, this is how it works. If you don't want to play the games anymore, then majority of you have to vote to stop playing. So there are seven of you, so that means four of you have to vote to not play the game anymore. So, who doesn't want to keep playing? I don't want to play anymore! You can count me out! Yeah, and I don't want to play anymore either! But Junior, isn't your dad going to ground you if you fail? I guess you're right. When my dad sees my grades, he's pretty much going to kill me anyway. I guess I'll keep playing. Uh, I don't want to play anymore, but this is too crazy for me. Uh, I don't want to play anymore either, because I'm Roy, and I'm too cool to play this, and I have too much to live for. All right, Crass, that's three people who voted to quit playing. You need one more vote in order to stop playing the games. Jeffy, what do you want to do? Come on, dude, in the games. It's not worth not having homework for a year. Wait, no homework for a whole year? Huh, I want to keep playing. Okay, that means we're going to keep playing these games. Yes! Woohoo, yeah! Oh, you guys suck. This isn't worth dying for. All right, Crass. The next game we're going to play is called Misfortune Cookies. So if you want to have a cookie in any of these shapes, what shape would you pick? On the piece of paper in front of you, draw the shape of the cookie you would want. Ooh, I want a circle cookie, because Chips Ahoy cookies are circles. That's very creative, Junior. Ooh, I'm going to do triangle, like a Christmas tree. Ooh, I'm going to do a square, because it reminds me of the box I'm going to live in when I'm homeless. You guys are all picking lame shapes. I'm going to do a star cookie. All right, I think everyone's done drawing their shapes. Hey, you, go pass out the cookies. I told you square because it looks like SpongeBob square pants. I chose a star because I am one. I'm cool. I chose triangle because it looks like the tip of my pee pee. What the hell is this? This is a weird cookie. Can we eat it? No, Crass, you cannot eat the cookie. Too late. All right, Crass, you cannot eat the cookie. What you're supposed to do is, is cut the shape out of the cookie without breaking the shape. If you break the shape, you'll get eliminated. No, oh, come on, that's impossible. I got the hardest shape. Yeah, my shape's really hard. I got the easiest shape. Mine's easy too, dude. Ha, looks like I'm moving to the next round. Oh, where do I even start? I did it, I did it. I did it too. <sighs> Great, I'm really happy for you guys. Oh, God, Oh, yeah, that's not stressful at all. I'm doing it, okay? Jeez, just... Uh, oh, boy. Oh, don't break, don't break, don't break. Uh, well, I love you, Ken. Ah! Cody died! Dude, hurry up! Don't die! Uh, okay. I'll try it, I'll try it! Oh, poor Cody. <laughs> uh, Mr. Jacket, dude? I broke mine. Can I have another one? They killed Roy! The Roy! I thought Roy was too cool to die. Come on, Junior, take your cookie out. I'll take you out on a date and pull those pigtails. Mm, 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 mm. I hope your cookie breaks. <sighs> I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Um, teacher, I'm done. Am I allowed to eat the cookie now? Yes, Crass. If you successfully get the shape out, you can eat the cookie. Yes, dude, I'm hungry. I'm not eating this. I don't know where it's been. Oh, <laughs> I don't know how to do this. Better hurry up, Junior. Oh, I'm, I'm going, I'm going. Um, All right, Cross, you've got 10 more seconds to get the shape out of the cookie or else he's going to blow your brains out. Hurry, dude. Ten, oh, I'm hurrying. No. Oh, I don't want to mess this up. Hurry seven, up, Junior. Six, Come on, I believe in you, dude. Five, I don't want you to die. Four, oh, three, here it goes. I'm going to try to break it. Two, uh, one. I did, I did, I did, I did. I didn't break it. Yes, dude. Aw, man. To break. Oh, I move on to the next round. Congratulations, Crass. Four of you are moving on to the next round. All right, go get rid of all the dead bodies. All right, Crass, we're going to take a quick break so I can get your next game set up. I switch seats. Uh, guys, what do you think the next game's going to be? Well, there's four of us, so maybe we'll play four square. No, dude, it's going to be freeze tag, and if you get tagged, you die. <laughs> well, I think whoever has the shortest wiener is going to die, so you can go ahead and shoot me. Aha! 
You're the one that's been doing this. Come here. All right, Kraus. For the next game, you're going to need to pick a partner. So go ahead and choose someone to be partners with. Pick a partner? Ooh, pick me, dude. I'm your best friend. I know, Joseph, but what if the next game is to make a baby? I want to be partners with Penelope. If that's the next game, go ahead and shoot me. Dude, that's not going to be the next game. We're kids. Pick me. I guess you're right, Joseph. Let's be partners. Yes. Oh, sweet. Nah, that means I get to be partners with a girl with boobies. We got this, Jeffy. We're going to win. No, me and Joseph are going to win. Yeah. All right, Kraus. Now that you have your partners, let's start the next game. Wait, where, where, where'd my little guy go with the gun? Oh, damn it, let me go see where he went. Ugh, all right, I took that guy's suit. Oh, man, this thing's sick. I'm gonna wear it when I go skiing. Hey, what's taking you so long? Uh, I, I had to pee. You're not supposed to talk, come on! What? All right, stand right there and shut up! Is this a classroom? Shut up! Okay, jeez. All right, Cross. so the next game we're gonna play is heads or tails. So each group is gonna get one quarter, and then each of you is gonna pick a side, either heads or tails. And then you're gonna flip that quarter, and whatever side the quarter lands on, whoever had that side gets to live, and the other person gets shot by this guy. I'm sorry, what? All right, let's get started. Oh man, Joseph, I don't wanna play this anymore. Me either, dude. I thought we were gonna be on the same team, not going against each other. I don't want you to die, Joseph. I don't want you to die, dude. <laughs> well, let's get these over with. What side you want? Tails never fails. All right, well, that means I'm heads. Well, Wait, wait, wait. What side is it? I can't see in this mask. It's tails, so I win. Oh, okay. Well, I'm going to be honest. I, I don't really know what the hell I'm supposed to do. You're supposed to shoot him. I won. Like, like with this Nerf gun? Yeah. Oh, oh okay. What's that going to do? Jesus Christ, this is a real gun? Yeah, they make it look like a Nerf gun. No, 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 no. I'm shutting this shit down right now. All right, that's it. I'm not playing this game anymore. I'm a cop and you're under arrest. Okay, well, you see this remote control? Yeah. And you see that suit you're wearing? Yeah. Well, if I press this button on this remote control, that suit will self-destruct. Well, looks like I'm shooting some people. That's what I thought. All right, you better hurry up and flip that coin. Uh, Joseph, what side do you want? The side that'll win? Uh... What side would you choose? Oh man, that's tough. I mean, it's literally 50-50, so it doesn't really matter. Well, help me choose. Listen, kid, if I tell you what side to pick, and you pick that one, and then you die, I'm gonna feel bad. I'm gonna have to live with that on my conscience, especially because I'm gonna be the one who shoots you. <sighs> well, ooh, what if we both choose heads? Yeah, if, if, if we both choose heads and it lands on heads, can we both live? Yeah, I like that. Uh, what if they both pick heads and it lands on heads? Can they both live? You can't do that. One's gotta pick tails, and one's gotta pick heads. Sorry, you heard him. You gotta pick one or the other. Oh, okay, well, what, what if when we flip the quarter, it lands on the side of the quarter? Like, it doesn't land on each side. Yeah. Huh. What if when they flip it, it lands on the side of the coin and not either of the other sides? Well, by the off chance of that happening, you flip the quarter again. You keep flipping it until it lands on a side. Yeah, you heard him. You gotta flip it again. Well, what if it never lands on a side? What if it keeps landing? I, I think he's gonna insist that it lands on one side or the other. <sighs> okay, Joseph, what side do you want? Oh, I want tails, dude. What? Well, I want a tails. Dude, I want it first. Okay, how about we flip the quarter to find out who gets tails. If you don't flip the quarter right now, I'm shooting both of you. Oh, okay. I'll be heads. Okay. All right, flip the quarter. <laughs> it's heads, it's heads. Shoot him, shoot, shoot him. Wait, I thought it was your friend, dude. Well, well, well. We're down to the final two. Junior and Penelope. What's the next game gonna be? Shut up! It's on the board! Oh, yeah, I guess it is. I just can't really see too good out of this mask. Shut your PlayStation controller face up! All right, anyway, Junior and Penelope, your final game is one round of rock, paper, scissors. You're gonna play that round, and whoever loses gets eliminated. And the last person standing is the winner. You ready, Junior? Uh, why is your hand in your skirt? Because I don't want you to see what I picked. Can I put my hand up your skirt to choose what I want? Oh, just go! Uh, what would you pick? Listen, man, you're on your own this time. Okay, uh, rock, rock paper, paper, scissors, scissors shoot! shoot! Ew, why does your finger smell like fish? Oh my god, I won! Uh, wait, wait, what is it? I can't see in this mask. This mask sucks! He has paper and I have scissors! No, 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 this is rock. That's not a rock, Junior. Uh, yeah, yeah, it is. It's, it's a very flat rock. No. Yeah, 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 no, this is a oh, flat okay, rock. Okay, okay, listen, I'm getting tired of this. Uh. Oh, my God, I won! Yay, my daughter won! What, Dad? Yeah? What are you doing here? This is awful! Oh, come on, it's not like I signed up for this. Did you not hear the thing about the suit exploding? Congratulations, Penelope! You're the winner of Squid Game! I don't know why it's called that, but you're the winner! So that means you get an A-plus for the rest of the year and no more homework. Yay! 
Congratulations, Penelope. I'm really proud of you. Thanks, Dad. Yeah, so just go home and tell your mother that she is a fat cow and tell her to stop eating so much. That's why you got divorced, Dad. Yeah, it is. And now I'm going to go home to my other wife I don't like. <gasps> me, Karen. Boy, me, is that you? Yeah. Why don't you dress like a ninja? It's just, I I had a thing I had to do. Well, how was your day, boy, me? I, I just, you know what, I really just don't want to talk about. Who's my little cuddle muffin? Oh, who's my little snuggle bear? I am my little strawberry shortcake. With a cherry on top? Of course with a cherry on top. Oh, Are you cherry? guys done? Jeffy, how long have you been standing there? Long enough to throw up in my mouth and swallow it. What do you want, Jeffy? I want some help building my Lego pirate ship. Jeffy, I don't have time to build a Lego pirate ship. But dang, it'd be really quick. It's only 1,260 pieces. And if it takes us 30 seconds per piece, that's only 630 minutes, which is only 10 and a half hours. So let's get started. Jeffy, I'm not going to assemble Legos for 10 and a half hours. Mark Marvin, you should spend more time with Jeffy. But my little cuddle muffin, I don't want to assemble Legos for ten and a half hours. Well, Boo Berry Bear, you could do the first five and a half hours, and then I could take over for the last five hours. But baby, I don't want to assemble Legos. Hey, Dad, check this out. If you buy me two more of these sets, we can build the Pirate House and the Pirate Island. Then we have the whole collection, and that would be the tits. I'm not buying you any more Legos, Jeffy, until you assemble this Lego set. So how about this? If you assemble the Lego Pirate Ship by yourself, then I'll buy the other two sets that you can assemble by yourself. How about that? One day, yesterday, I was watching this naughty video that had the exact same title, three in one. Jeffy, I'm not gonna assemble Legos with you, so take this to your room and assemble it by yourself. <laughs> Who's that? Hopefully someone to help me build my Lego shit. Oh, let me see what it is. Uh, hello? Help me! Help me, please! You have to hide me! Wait, are you Goodman's butler? Well, yes, but not anymore! It's a long story! Please, hide me! Please! Uh, okay, come upstairs! Thank God! So, Marvin, who was at the door? It was Mr. Goodman's butler. My name is Chives. Well, Chives, what are you doing here? I had to run away from Mr. Goodman. I couldn't stand the constant bickering and nagging and him demanding me to say sir at the end of every sentence. Sir. Well, why'd you run away? Why didn't you just quit? Because he would kill me. You don't understand. I'm the 14th butler this year. I've seen things. Things he doesn't want the world to know. So if a butler wants to quit, he just kills them. Well, you can stay here. I, I promise you, he's not going to come looking for you here. Thank you. What? Who's that? That must be him. Please, you have to hide me now. I'll do anything. Oh, oh hide in the bathroom. <sighs> okay, I, I'm going to go answer the door and, and, and tell him he's not here. Uh, hello? You shithead here? Who? That bald-headed bastard. What? I don't know who you're talking about. My butler, Marvin! What? I didn't even know you had a butler. Oh, stop tugging my balls, Marvin. I know he's here because I have a tracker in his colon. And my Find My Butler app led me right to your house. What? Your Find My Butler app? Well, I didn't... There, there's no butler in my house. Your phone must be acting up. Oh, really? Because if I press this button, it'll shock his colon. What? You don't have to press that. I'm gonna press it. Well, don't, don't, don't press it. I'm pressing it. <laughs> Found him. What? Hmm. The Find My Butler app says he's in here. He's not in my bathroom. We should go check another room. He could be in your shower. He's not in the shower. Let's see. <laughs> there he is. What? No, no, that's just my screaming shower curtain. I got it from Bed Bath & Beyond. Oh, really? I would love to see it scream again. <laughs> okay, look, I'll pull back the curtain to show you he's not in the shower. Okay. Run. Oh, yes, these pipes are lovely, Master Marvin. I was just fixing your pipes. Thank you so much for hiring me again. Oh, thank you so much for coming. Oh, Goodman, old chap. I didn't even notice you there. Oh, old Marvin here, he was just hiring me to fix his pipes. Did I say you can leave the house, Chimes? Well, well, no, sir, but I... That is unacceptable. That is three spankings for you with the paddle. Is that the paddle with or without the spikes, sir? The spikes. You know that, Chives. Now go warm my Lamborghini. Yes, sir. God, you're getting old. It's so hard to find good help around here, Marvin. Now walk me to the car. Uh, okay. All right, Chives. You know the Lamborghini doesn't come with heated seats, so I'm going to need you to pull your pants down and warm up my seat with your bare ass cheeks. Very good, sir. What are you doing? You don't have to take this. You can stand up for yourself. You can say, I don't want to work for you anymore, and stand up for yourself. <sighs> You know what, you're right. I don't have to take this anymore. I'm a man! Master! Did you just raise your voice at me, Chives? You have a dirty mouth. You get in that car! No, sir. I, I, I was just letting you know that I took the liberty to warm the baby oil for the butt spankings later. You rub that Vaseline all over those ass cheeks, Chives. Now get in the car! Yes, sir. Thanks for helping me find them, Marvin. You want to watch the spankings? Oh, no, I'm good. All right, he's going to get spankings in my car. Here it comes, Chives. 
one, sir. Stop tensing up. Uh, two, sir. Marvin, what was that all about? I don't know, but I don't want to talk about it. Okay. Danny, since you don't want to build the pirate ship, can we make a Play-Doh pizza and eat it? What? No, Jeffy, you can't eat Play-Doh. It's poisonous. Oh, that's why I run out of Play-Doh so fast. But then why did they make it look like pizza? It's supposed to be like a joke. <laughs> I'm not laughing, Daddy. Well, look, how about we do something else? What? Who's that? Hold on. Hello? Marvin, please! You have to hide me again! I escaped Goodman and those powerful spankings! But he has a track on your butt. He's gotta find you again. I need you to help me remove it! Now, come! Marvin, who's at the door this time? Marvin, quick! Stick your hand up my rear to get the tracking device out! Marvin, what is going on? I'm not sticking my hand up your butt. I'll do it. No, you're not gonna do it, Jeffy. Fine. I'll do it myself. <laughs> Oh, it came out! Oh, thank God! Hurry, grab it so we can flush it! I I'm not gonna grab it! Oh, fine, I'll do it myself! Ew! Why'd you put it in your mouth? <laughs> Alright, Marvin, flush it! Okay. Goodman will never find me now. Okay. Marvin, what is going on here? Look, there's a tracking device in his butt, and we flushed it so Goodman couldn't find him. Exactly! Oh no, that must be Goodman again. Marvin, please, you must hide me again. No, find your own hiding spot. Excellent idea. Uh, hello? Where is he? Uh, what's the bat for? I'm gonna beat his bald head with my baseball bat. This is my bald-headed baseball bat beater. Well, uh, I promise you, your butler's not in my house. My Find My Butler app said he's in the exact same spot that he was in last time. So I'm gonna go beat your screaming shower curtain with my baseball bat. <laughs> Okay. What? Uh, hold on. My find my butler app says he's right here. But no, he's not here. No. Oh, I see what you did. Wait, wait, what? You flushed him down the toilet, didn't you? I can't flush him down the toilet. Flush me down the toilet, Marvin. What? Flush you down the toilet? Yeah, I'm going in after him. Flush me down the toilet. Uh, uh, okay. All right, Marvin. Flush me. Okay. I'm coming for you, Chives. I'm coming! Marvin, can you please tell me what's going on? I just flushed Goodman down the toilet. What? Thank goodness, sir! I was hiding under the sink five more seconds and I think he would have found me! You saved my life! I'll do anything for you, sir. I'll, I'll be your servant. I'll cut your toenails! No, no, that, that's fine. You, you can just go home. But wait, Marvin! He's a butler. He could take care of Jeffy and do all the things with Jeffy that you don't want to do. What? Good thinking, baby. But well, you're so smart. Uh, yeah, yeah. He could he could build the Lego set and and, and the Play-Doh pizza. Uh, Chives, there is one thing you can do for me. Of course, anything, sir. I want you to be Jeffy's butler, you know, and, and do everything he says. Anything's better than working for Goodman, of course. All right, Jeffy. So this is Chives. He's your butler. He'll do anything you say. That is the tits. All right, butter pillow, baby. Let's go to the bedroom. Okay, Flutterby. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Y'all are gay. Indeed, sir. So, Master Helmethead, what is your first request, sir? Well, first I want you to build my 1,260-piece pirate Lego set. That is a lot of pieces. It might take me a little while, sir. Yeah, it'll take you exactly ten and a half hours. Because with 1,260 pieces and one piece every 30 seconds, that equals 630 minutes, which equals ten and a half hours. So you better get started. Of course, sir. I'll be on that right away. Great. Ugh. There you are, sir. Your Lego pirate ship. All 1,260 pieces. Huh. It took you 10 hours and 45 minutes. It was only supposed to take you 10 and a half hours. Well, you see, sir, there are many small pieces, and my vision's not as good as it used to be. Oh, oh well. Let's go see if it floats. Uh, floats, sir? Ah! That took me over 10 hours to build! It didn't float. Uh, of course it didn't, sir. There's no water in the tub. Oh, maybe we should have put water in it. Build it again. Uh, I think I saw a plate of pizza set upstairs. How about we go do that instead? Okay, let's go make a pizza. Thank God. All right, sir. Your Play-Doh pizza is ready. Eat it. You want you want me to eat it, sir? Yeah, eat it. I would rather not. I eat it all the time. It's good. Eat it. Sir, I, I would rather not. I uh, said eat it! Yes, sir. Of course, sir. Mmm, mmm. So good, sir. Take a real bite. Yes, sir. <laughs> What's that over there, sir? Where? Oh, wow, that was so good. 
That was so delicious. I, I could have another. Oh, you ate it already? I'll just make another one. Uh, no, sir. I, I'm so stuffed from the first one. I, I couldn't dare. But why don't we do something else? All right. Here, make me some water balloons. Yes, sir. Sir, your water balloons are ready. All right, thanks. Do with them as you wish, sir. Oh, well, it didn't break. Please don't do that again, sir. The, sir, good heavens! Don't, don't put that down, sir. That, that well, really that one didn't break either. You, you know, uh, ow, sir. Sir, I, I must implore you, please. Let's, how about we go do something else, sir? All right. So I decided you need to wear a uniform. Sir, I already am wearing a uniform. No, I think you need to wear something more formal. Put this on. Sir, this is a chicken suit. Yeah, put it on. Must I absolutely have to, sir? Did I stutter? I said put it on! You did not stutter, sir. I will get to it right away. I have put on the chicken suit, sir. Alright, good. Now I want you to act like a chicken. Of course, sir. Bok. Bok bokok. No, that's not realistic enough. I want you to act like a real chicken. I will do my best, sir. Good. Now, I want you to color a page out of this coloring book. Which one, sir? Just pick one, any one of them, but it's got to be perfectly within the lines. Absolutely, sir. Right on it. Sir, your perfectly colored book as requested. Chimes? What the heck? W whatever do you mean, sir? You colored outside the lines, you blind old fart! Oh. Idiot! Uh, sir, the ears were hard to see, and there's a beak in my face. Well, find another picture and color it perfectly, dummy! <laughs> You know what? No! I don't have to deal with this anymore! Not from you, nor from Goodman! I quit! Good day, sir! I don't have to deal with this anymore! Oh, Goodman, old chap! Where have you been? In the sewer, looking for your tracker that's supposed to be in your butt! Uh, that must have fell out when I used the restroom earlier, sir. Mm. Uh, actually, you know what? I don't have to deal with this anymore, sir! I'm finally sticking up for myself! I quit! Oh, oh no, you quit? Oh, uh, are you working for Chick-fil-A? Is that what this is? Uh, well, no, but anything's better than working for you, you old bag! Wow, no one's ever stood up for me before. It almost, it almost sounds like you need to put this chip back in your ass. Good day, sir. Well, you know what? I got 20,000 different reasons why you should put that microchip back in your ass. Shall I warm the Lamborghini with my butt cheeks, sir? Indeed. Absolutely, sir. Get your ass back in the car. Jeffy, how's your butler doing? Yeah, you having fun? No, he quit. He quit? Yeah, but it's okay, Daddy. I got this new Lego set. And I know you were upset about the last one because it was going to take like ten and a half hours. But this one's only a thousand and two pieces. And at 30 seconds per piece, that'll take 501 minutes and just under eight and a half hours. Well, get started, Marvin. <sighs> okay, let's build this.